da ba da 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 <laughs> For the past five minutes, like an addict. <laughs> uh... do, 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 ba, ba, da, ba. <laughs> what have you done? There's puppers. There's puppers. There's puppers. There's puppers. There's puppers. Hello, puppers. You're a good boy. Yes, you are. He snuggled in right behind me just for the warmth. Little oh, pupper, he's, he's cute. When he wants to be. Yeah, that's right, the monitor. <laughs> oh, the monitor is nuts. Um, the monitor, thankfully, is working for right now. Um, I have no idea what went on with that. It it was um, it just suddenly started glitching out on me. Hopefully, it doesn't do it again. But yeah, I have no idea what it was wrong with it. I restarted my computer, fiddled around with the cord, and everything's fine and back to normal. So I don't need to get myself a whole new monitor now. That's that's a plus side. I don't have to spend money. It's always a plus side, right? What's what's in the budget? Free. Free is in the budget, everybody. Hello! Nice to see everybody. It feels like it's been longer than five days since the last time that we uh, streamed. It really does. Arctic! Good to see you too. <laughs> I thought the little little video of uh, me and my wife inside of the voice chat was, was funny. I thought it was funny. Thank you very much for that. Ah, it's uh, Merrick. It's Merrick42. Thank you very much for the follow. So today we are going to be doing a little animation, just a short animation. If you guys remember uh, back when we made, uh, what was it, the Evil Zoomavoid animation? The Evil Zoomavoid animation. I think we're going to do one of those again. We're going to do a short little animation, but this one time it's going to be about good times with Scar. I loved his, I loved his, uh magical base so i want to do an animation about him returning to magic so i think that's going to be the theme of today is going back to magic uh screen cap keys is that what you're going to poke me about is that what you're going to poke me about i just saw the command oh no that didn't pop up oh no stuffing things uh let's see here 
Let's go to main overlay alert properties. Let's do a refresh on that and trigger fire properties. Let's do a refresh on that. Bing bang. Okay, let's try mod poke. Try that again. Hey, there it goes. There we go. It just needed a quick reset. Hmm. There we go. Hydrate. Had to go get downstairs and get my, myself some water. Mm. Ah. Bing bang. Oh, why didn't Genfire work? Maybe that. Oh, there's probably a uh, 60 second cooldown on everything. I should reduce some of those cooldowns, shouldn't I? Especially for ones that moderators can only control. Oh well. <laughs> uh, I've missed somebody's, uh, so many people's uh, comments back up here. Thank you very much. Uh, it, it does, I do like the outfit. It looks uh, uh, like I could uh, take on the spring. I could bear it. Hmm. In your browser, there's servers, you guys. <laughs> Feel like I people's names, but not being able to remember. Yes, same here, same here. Seeing people's names, not being able to remember them. Mo I think everybody here, though, I recall for sure. I haven't seen a name that I've been like, oh, I recognize you, don't remember. But no, everybody here I recognize. All familiar, familiar faces. So, all right. Mr. Good Times with Scar. How are we going to do you? Well, we've got to bring in some assets. So let's go ahead and do that, shall we? The penguin. There we go. Now that we see the animation. Pen. Let's bring in... Actually, I also want to put on randomized music. There we go. Oh, we need to bring in some items. Go to our very, very familiar Minecraft palette. Let's bring in some people. Collections. Mm, I haven't gotten very far on the, on the uh, away screen. Eventually I'll have to start working on that when I'm away. <laughs> Uh, let's see here. People. I want people. People does not start with P-O. P-E. There we go. New people. I want to bring in that. And I want to bring in probably items and... Ooh, probably items and palette I think I'm going to bring in. Let's bring in those two. File. Append. Here we go. Let's bring in pal. Do 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 do. P A. You can do it. There we go. Perfect. Good 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 good. Bring in some blocks. All the Minecraft blocks. Cause we're gonna need them all. Mm, good file and I want to append in a bunch of items items because I know I at least want a desk from the items collection here mm, there it is perfect all right and I think that's gonna be the last thing that we're gonna need for right now I don't know completely where to go it uh, except for the beginning. The beginning, I know how I want it to start out. We're going to change this to unused. Get things organized. New collection. I should just make a startup. A startup file that has all of this stuff all ready for me. Let's see here. Actors. And new collection. This one is going to be called land. Put the unused down below. There we go. Do, do, do. People. I want... 
Uh, good times with Scar. I don't know what he is. If he's 64 by 64, there's the Tidex in animation. <laughs> Welcome in, Tide. Oh, one of the reasons that I'm kind of late for this, for the, um, for today's stream is, uh, yeah, I was kind of messing around on, on, on the modded server. <laughs> and then it was like, oh no, I don't, I forgot to what time it was. Mm. Gotta keep track of time. Let's see here. I want C. 3D rendering, textures, Minecraft skins, Hermitcraft skins, good times with Scar. Oh, large icons. You are 64 by 64. Thank goodness. All right. Let's grab you. You are going to go into Actors. And we want you. Let's get rid of all of these unused for right now. Let's move you into frame. Or rather, just over here. Merp. Okay. And I'm thinking we're going to start out as a mayor. And what I want to do... Have, have any of you seen a, a really obscure movie called Mark Twain? It's a stop-motion movie movie um recently there was a bunch of hype around the scene where the devil um kind of shows the kids uh, a a village and then he kills all of the villagers inside of it and it was inside of this movie and it was just it was a very very weird scene and it was meant for kids this movie was meant for kids so it was really strange but there's a scene in that movie where there's where they find an alternate version of mark twain and there's all of these pillars of books and papers and so forth and what i want to try and do is recreate that area where they're walking through all of these books and papers and such forth and at the end of the hall you see uh, good times with Scar at his desk, just writing away, writing away. And then, um, eventually his little pencil starts to have these little march magic sparkles on it and starts to remind him of, uh, the magic area that he left behind. And I want to start to transition into some, uh, just cool scene of him turning back into his, uh, into his magician. Now would be a great time to save. Thank you very much, Nightbot. Good idea. Let's go ahead and go back. 3D projects. Let's see here. Projects, channel test. We want a good time for magic. <laughs> Actually, good times. Actually, we're going to call this good times with magic. We're going to call this good times with magic. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Sleepy, how you doing? Hey, hey, go, 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 go. screen keys, right? Oh, Dang it! I almost remembered it too. She's almost. To get your attention. Attention. In the chat. Sleepy, I hear you're uh, soon going to be coming out with a Patreon. Is that correct? I believe. Do 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 do. Let's bring up the items. So I'm going to have to get a bunch of items for this area. Let's go ahead and see what we can gather up in order to create this scene, shall we? So we're going to need a desk. Let's just go ahead and straight up and move this into land. There we go. This is going to be the desk. Bloop. Rup. Okay, you are at desk. Desk, desk shrink. Shrink desk. Bring on up. There we go. Something like so. Yes, I am doing digital icons. Cool. Uh, <laughs> when will you get a Patreon? When will I get a Patreon? Um, when I have a normal time schedule. 
that's when I will get a pa- Patreon because then I can can have some consistency because I want to have a Patreon where it's month uh, where it's monthly rather than by by video because you've seen my videos they come out like like once every six months maybe once every year <laughs> so I got to get a normal time frame in order to uh, have a Patreon. Uh, thankfully, uh, what is it in a tomorrow? Tomorrow is going to be the day that I uh, finally go into a sleep study because I got to figure out if I got sleep apnea or narcolepsy or whatever it is. Got something. Got something on me that's um, killing my sleep, and I'm not sure exactly what it is. Owl! Good to see you, Owl. Let's bring in chair. Let's go ahead and bring in this guy. We want to move you into land. Bring in a chair. And let's see here. Books and stuff. There should be some stuff over here that looks really good for... For books yes here we go look at this this is what I'm gonna need bunch of books and bookshelves all individually created all right let's go ahead and uh, move this into land I do want to take a look at this Ugh, bleh. we're gonna have to move that into its own category Move into a new collection. We want to call this book bookshelf. Yeah, let's let's make a whole new thing for that. Ugh, that is not good. Items bookshelf. Here we go. Organization makes things a ton easier. We are in global. Good. We can move all that over here. What are you attached to? Oh, you're still attached to this. What? Interesting. Interesting. Land a bookshelf, yes. What are you attached to? It is attached to something over here. Oh! Oh, that's what's going on. Oh, my bad. Okay. You need to move back over to here. You're part of the tool shelf. That's what you're attached to. Okay. Because there's saws and hammers that are apparently separate items on this cool little workbench here. That's interesting. Okay. But all of you, however... You can come on over here to Mr. There we go. Good. And you look like a nice bookshelf, too. Let's take you and move you over to land as well. Move to land. Zoot. There we go. Puka, why is everything so dark? The, currently, it's dark because I don't have a light source. I just went straight to rendering. Sorry. Mm. Do, do, do. Saws and hammers are part of the mm, tools you need to analyze the books. <laughs> yes, that's exactly why you need it. You need a hammer to inspect books. <laughs> When um when you get one of those books that says um it's a do it do it yourself book or uh, how to use tools, it, you just pick up one of those books and just hammer in nails using the book. <laughs> <laughs> Is this how this book works? I'm not quite sure. sure. The council agrees. Owl is cute. 
It has been agreed upon. It is written. It shall be done. Let's see here. What else can we add into this little library that we have of his? Ooh, ooh, I got it. We can add, we can, we can make a whole library about this too. It, it won't show up that much into the animation, but I do like the idea of having in it a library and such. Mm, different floors and stuff. Actually, come to think of it. Um, I'm wondering if I should just make a whole, a whole area. You know what? I got it. Yeah, I, I'll probably make a whole area, but... Um, how do I want to make it? How do I want to make this area? Do I want to make the, the, the library in Blender itself, or do I want to go into Minecraft and then build the room? I think I can make the library in Blender. I don't think I need too much for the library. Yeah, because uh, all I all I would need is a bunch of bookshelves and a and a floor and then some more bookshelves in between there. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Guys. Mm, I just realized something. You see this right here? You see this this chess table right here? <laughs> I am a doofus. I am an utter complete doofus. Um I'm going to open up something else here. 3D blending. Um uh, let's see here. Projects, uh, zoom avoid, zoom avoid projects, and let's go to thumbnails. And I think it's uh, 2021, and I think it's in January. Yeah, here it is. <laughs> oh my gosh. So zoom avoid wanted this thumbnail for for his thing, and I made all of those chess pieces inside the game. I didn't need to do any of that. I didn't need to make any, all of those chess pieces. It was literally right here inside of this free resource. This chess table, right here. I made my own, my own pieces. I'm a doofus. <laughs> uh, sometimes, sometimes it helps to have uh, some good resources. What is this? Oh, this is a vial. This is this is a um, a glass vial. Oh, okay. It looks weird in Eevee. Okay. Doofus me. Okay, so I think what I can do is I can make yeah I can use the fancy bookshelves in order to make the library. And I think I can just do the magic old array modifier. Fancy old array modifier. Let's go ahead and use you. Um, so in case any of you watching this is uh, using this array modifier, of course, if you give it a factor of one, it basically puts all the items right next to each other, and it works perfect for Minecraft. Put in a second array modifier, and we're going to go on the Z coordinate of one. And X coordinate of zero. There we go. Let's go ahead and build this wall on up. There we go. Perfect. We got one of the walls. Oh look! It's not good times with Scar, it's Genfire! <laughs> Let's move that ladder out of there really quickly. Um, duplicate this guy, and we are going to rotate on the z-axis by... Ooh, nope. Rotate on the z-axis by 90... No. 
negative 90. There we go. Much better. Okay, and then let's go ahead and increase this one. There we go. And then we are going to duplicate you. And then we are going to move you... Ah! Yeah, let's rotate on the Z-axis by 180. Whoop. Whoop. Rotate Z, 180. Okay, something, something felt a little bit weird there. And... We're going to change this from Z to negative 1. Nope, that didn't work. This one. I want you to be negative 1. Negative 1? Perfect! There we go. That's what I want. Now I can make this hall as wide or as narrow as I want it to be. And let's see here. Let's increase the height a little bit. There we go. Increase the height. That's good enough. Uh, one more just to make sure. So 18. Let's increase this to 18. Good. Duplicate you. And we are going to move you into the... Ooh, nope. We're going to move you into the center a bit. Do, 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 do. Rotate Z. Nine, nope, nope. Negative 90. There we go. Bring down these array modifiers. And lower on down. Two. There we go. Much better. Much, much better. <laughs> Sleepy Owl. Yes, yeah, Sleepy it is. It is quite late for you, Owl. Thank you very much for the follow there. Tio Mara. Um, that is a tall. Yes, I want it to feel infinite. That's what I want the uh, the library to feel. A very um, encroaching. If you are inside of it, like it's falling in on you. That's how I want it to feel. Hmm. Go ahead and duplicate this. I think that's a good size for the library. I think I put it on an odd number, which actually I like. So let's continue that. <laughs> I just thought of something. Um, what if... What if I delete that, add another array modifier, okay, and I'm going to give this a, I'm going to give this a negative, uh, a negative three, negative three. Ooh, perfect. Hold on. Instead of negative three, let's go negative two. Negative two. Uh, negative 2.5. And it needs to be a negative 2.5. Perfect. There we go. Now, um, let's go ahead and add on yet another array mod. So we got four array, mo three array modifiers here. We're going to add on another array modifier on top of that. And we are going to go not in the x-axis. That's going to be 0. We want the y-axis. We're going to go by yeah, 2. 2. Okay, we need to go negative 2. Negative 2. Negative 2. Uh, negative 4. There we go. I like that. There we go, negative four. And then let's move this up a little bit, like so. And then we just have to increase this number. Ah, look at that. We got ourselves pillars of books here. I like it. So now, so now the camera is going to come down this way through these 
Isle ways of books. I like that. Ah, I'm glad we decided to do this in Blender. I like that. Array modifiers are so fun. <laughs> Especially when we're working with Minecraft. It makes things so much easier. And uses so little uh, CPU, computer usage. It's, it's all awesome. Okay. So now... Let's go ahead and take our little ladder here. Let's move you on up. Move it on up. Bra! Puppies need the treats! Yeah, they do. Puppies need treats. Puppies need treats. Puppies need the treats. Akida. Akida. Hi, John. Where are you going? Hi. There's the face. Hello. Hello, face. Have some treats. Where's your GoPro? Remy's. Up here. Up here. So where people can see you. Right here. So they can see you. Nom noms. I know. <laughs> mm. There you go. Nom nom. Good pup pups. So I got a kilo, the, the, the one on the couch right now. He's laying behind me. Since it's really cold over uh, here in Ohio, um, these guys have been just the, um, the best thing as giant living hot water bottles. And that's just like, can we please snuggle with you? So they've been uh, wonderful like that. There you go. Well, they just snuggle on in. Now, let's see here. I want this ladder to be against this wall. Let's go ahead and move you over a block. That'll do. Uh, let's duplicate this guy. And we are going to... Let's put you right here. And duplicate you again. Um... Shift this and then control right there. That looks good. Okay. And let's move this out a little bit and rotate down. So the ladder leans against the bookshelf. Pull it out a little bit and lean further this time. Oop, not control. I want shift. Much better. Okay. Same thing with this dude. Bring you on out. I want to see the ladder. There we go. Rip. Right there. Perfect. Okay. You're also going to need a floor. Mm, what would be a good floor? Ooh, got a bunch of oak around here, so we might as well get some dark oak in here, too. And let's get some organization happening. Land, we need uh, walls. Let's put you in there. Okay, and then new, and I want to put in ladders. Take these guys, shove them into that. And new, and I want desk. Desk. So, tear and chable? Tear and chable. <laughs> tear and chable. <laughs> if I could English well, that would be wonderful. Okay, tear and chable. Let's get good times with Scar. Let's get good times with Scar's skin here. Do, 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 do. We want not Genfire. We want Hermitcraft skins. Good time with Scar. There you are. And we want the Mayor. You know what? I don't have his magical one. I need to get his magical one. Hold on. 
Meow. Do, 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 do. Minecraft. False symmetry. Here we go. Do, do, do. I want good time with Scar. I think it's good time with Scar. Not good times with Scar. Yes, that's it. And I want the magical one. Heh, <laughs> Scarecrow. Where, where, where is the fourth magic? Magic man! There you are! I see you, magic man. Download. <laughs> Tear and table, yeah. Oh, thank you very much, Murphy. <laughs> Uh, let's see here. Let's drag you into... This is not the folder that I wanted. This is not the folder. Let's cut... Pr 3D rendering, textures, Minecraft skins, Hermitcraft skins, Good Time with Scar, Paste. Oh! Oh, I did have it. Oh my gosh. I did have the skin. I know what I'm doing. 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 Hmm. How you will do Scar's eyes in Blender. Um, I'm not... I'm not too concerned about Scar's eyes. Scar's eyes are pretty easy to do in Blender. Th his mouth, however, is going to be a problem. Yeah. Mm, yeah. His mouth is going to be a problem. I'm thinking I'm going to have to take liberties on his mouth a bit and just change it up completely. So that, yeah, his, his mouth has got to got to change a bit and I do need to make uh, two versions for the blender of Minecraft scar because I do have to do the lawyer version and I do have to do the magical version so Minecraft skins Hermitcraft skins good times of scar organization everybody it's what you need for sure Let's grab in the magical one. Do, do, do. Zoom on in. There we go. Yeah, the eyes are super easy. And let's grab... Uh, Mayor. Bring him in too. Okay. So how do I want to do the mouth? Hmm... How do I want to do the mouth? I think I think we're just gonna skip skip what the mouth actually what the mouth is, and we are just gonna use the one provide that I have provided because it is just a smirk. It is his lips, but I don't think he's gonna have that brown of lips. Silver, hey, how you doing, Silver? Good to see you. Give Silver a shout out, please. Shout out. <laughs> Some of the times that I actually like uh, the pretty horses that show up every now and then is is for those little animations. <laughs> so some late night drawn. So ooh yes. Cool, cool. All right, so Scar, we need to fix your face. I think we're just gonna color you in a bit. Three, two, one, pretty horses. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Three, two, one, pretty horses. <laughs> Silver's drawings are very pretty, for sure. Oh, oh, they're not rasterized. That's why I can't work on them. Uh, rasterized layer. That's why. 
keep forgetting. That's that's why I can't work on some of these layers. Um. Okay, let's go ahead and grab some of Good this double. Not looking too hot right now. You need something that looks prettier. Outfit change. <laughs> Puka, Puka, hey, it's still cold out. You know that, right? Yeah, that's why I got on, you know, um, Bouncy Bear's hoodie, you know, and I got some pretty good slacks here, and I got some uh, gloves on. You know, it's nice and nice and warm. You need a scarf. Well, yeah, I think adding a scarf would, to this outfit would look really good. Okay, behind the stretch bush, please. Be behind, behind the stretch bush, but <laughs> you're just giving me a, giving me a scarf. Uh, right? Yes, that's correct. Okay. Well, first give us his hoodie and stuff for us. Okay. Let me give you... Puka dress up better. Alright. Um, I got the, the scarf on. Awesome! You gave us the hoodie. Well, can, can I have both the scarf and the hoodie at the same time? Nuh-uh. This looks fashionable. You know, the purple kind of clashes with the red a little bit, you know, so we got to make sure you look stylish, okay? All right, bye. I don't feel any warmer. <laughs> uh, um, pretty horses, 100% style, 0% lack of common sense. Thank you. Thank you very much. 0% lack of common sense. <laughs> Let's grab a little bit more stubble color here. Uh, let's grab this one. And we will paint that into the here. Good. All right. I think what I can do is I can just copy this face and put it onto this one here. Perfect. All right. Good. So now let's... Take this layer and that layer, and let's merge layers. Is that one rasterized? Yeah, that one's rasterized. Okay. So file, save as, and we want to save this as a PNG. No, not a Pixar. Thank you very much. We're not making a Disney film here. Uh, magic, magic scar, blender. Blender, save. Okay, and I want this one. File, save as magic. No, wait, mayor. May, mayor, scar, blender. And you need to be a PNG. Save. Okay. And we are just going to save as scar blender raw save we're gonna save the photoshop file of that all right we should only need photoshop for that good mm. <laughs> mm. less warm puka <laughs> Zero percent lack of common sense. <laughs> uh, uh, Kawaii Live. Hello, Kawaii Live. Thank you very much, Kawaii. <laughs> Hug. Hug. At. Uh, why? Doo -doo. <laughs> Let's put the skin on Scar. Let's put the skin on the Scar. So now we have Blender. Interesting. Oh, oh, that's right. It uses PSD, right? <laughs> I know how this. I know how this works. I know how this works. Thank you very very much for the follow. Now that you are a follower, you can edit your character down there at the bottom. You can customize him. 
do 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 all right scars face how do we work on scars face um actor ba da bum 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 ba da ba da whoop we want this but we want just the face portions give me the face portions here we go Mm, let's move this guy on down. Uh, yeah, because we're not going to be doing any voices. So we can just move this face on down a bit. There we go. Mm, close it up a bit. Nope, wrong one. This one. Close it up a bit. There we go. And what are Scar's eyes? I forget. Uh, UV editing, scar, no, mm. oh goodness sakes, which one is it? Layout, I need to go to this really quickly before I lose something. Um, I'm not going to be able to find it again, am I? What color is his eyes? Do... Oh, they are green. I don't think they're the right green, though. Let's drop... No, let's... Let's drop this in here really quickly. Okay. Drag this out of frame. There we go. Now I can go to shading. Zoop. Zoop. And I want these eyes. Thank you very much. Let's open up Scar. Good times with Scar. Here we go. Now I can see what color green they are. And I want this green to be that green. There we go. Much, much, much better. Okay. Guys, in chat, if you... Um... <laughs> All right, if you like what you see, like the scarf. This scarf is nice, nice and purpley. I like this scarf. Hit the follow button if you like the scarf. <laughs> no, wait. If you're already followed, don't hit the follow button again. <laughs> oh no, I've lost viewers. Just because I said hit the follow button, but I did not take into consideration they were already following. All right, so let's get Scar in a chair, shall we? Scar in chair. Do 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 do. Shrink it down just a little bit more. There we go. Do 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 do. Get these hands on top of the table. Okay, get those elbows out. Elbows out, everybody. We. <laughs> Do you know what the name of the little skin on the on your elbow is? Just. Uh. <laughs> I believe that's how it's spelt. It's the little uh, piece of skin on on your elbow. <laughs> Thank you very much for the follow there, Murphy. Now that Murphy has followed, everything's gonna follow Murphy's Law, am I right? <laughs> everything's just gonna fall apart. Murphy, how could you? It is. That's, 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 that's what it's called.
little piece of skin called um, is called that. I feel weird saying that out loud on stream. <laughs> Um, I think to have him in a good position, I think Scar's legs are actually going to dangle. <laughs> uh, they're going to dangle off of the chair. It's not going to be well seen, but you're, but you will know it. And have him hunched over onto the table. There we go. Let's get him kind of off center a little bit. There we go. Get those legs not perfect. Good to not have those perfect, perfect alignments. Let's move these over. That's good. Whoops. With chair. Over with chair. All right. Good. Ah! Oh, jeez. Grim, hi. <laughs> Oh. oh, man, when when you get scared, you are not as vocal. You are not as vocal when you get scared, Grim. <laughs> you go quiet when when you get scared. Ah, oh. <laughs> me on the other hand, <laughs> I'm like down the hall or something like that in 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 high school and I pull up my skirt going ah! <laughs> going oh. oh gosh <laughs> uh, let's get a floor in here shall we good to see you Grim ooh ooh you should shout out Grim I was just watching him today. Did you start that? Um, okay, now, now it, now it all finally clicked for me. Shout out on why you were doing the uh, the Sky Factory starting out, and it's just like, wait a minute, didn't you have all this stuff? Oh, that's right. You're starting on the single player, right? Right. Okay, now I get it. It finally clicked on me. <laughs> ah, jeez, Jiminy Christmas, yo. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get a floor in here, shall we? I need to go on to the pilot. Thank you both for the 50 biddies. I appreciate that. Let's grab some dark oak. Dark oak. Dark oak. Um, where is dark oak? Should be around here somewhere. Uh, land. Get rid of land so I can see things. Well, I just jittered that time. Goodness sakes. <laughs> uh, heart is still beating really fast here. Like in a stealth game, you gotta wait until the uh, until the person calms down a little bit until you uh, blackjack them over the head in order to make them uh, knock out. Gotta let things settle, and then then I'll probably scream again. <laughs> but I did jump a little bit. I just kind of waved my hands in my air. My air? My air. It's mine. Not my dog's. It's mine. Where is Dark Oak? Dark. Dark Oak. Where are you? No. Mm, Dark Oak Plain? No. Bushy? No. Do 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 stripped. That's that's the log. I want um dark oak planks. Oh there it is. It's right behind the um item frame. That's why I couldn't find it. Alright. You duplicate. Move over to land. Thank you very much. We'll put you in walls. Prepare. <laughs> Prepare? Sochi, you, you sound like Illidan 
from Warcraft. You were not prepared. S cooking your steak. Good. Good. I'm glad to hear. No, wait, wait, Grim. Could you do me a favor? Grim, can you take that steak uh, really quickly? Take it, take it and while it's in, in, in its cooking utensil. Pick it up. Raise it above your head. It's kind of risky, I know it, but you're raising the stakes. Just wanted to give that to you. Grab X.5. Okay, good. Um, let's move it over by the wall. Hilk! Poof! She! Ben, thank you again for the 50 biddies and Wiggly Fox. <laughs> Uh, Nightbok. Puka, pants, check. Are you wearing them? Good, carry on. <laughs> yes. I, 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 do, I don't have my hoodie, but I still have my pants. We're good. <laughs> hmm. Step one, you can't defend yourself from a bang. <laughs> uh, point five. There we go. I think that'll do. Oh, do I need to do that too? Grab Z.5. There we go. Dunk, chunk. There we go. Now it's perfectly aligned. Or should be, at least mildly so. Put you off in the corner. And again, add in our favorite array modifiers. Array, array. Instead of an array modifier, could it be a bob modifier? Uh, let's do a one. Okay, actually, these both need to be negative, don't they? Instead of <laughs> messing with m imaginary numbers here, negative one, what? Oh wait, no, that's the square root of negative one, I'm sorry. Square root of negative one is an imaginary number. Right. Not negative one by itself. By itself, negative one is fine. Oh. Scar looks like he's looking at something on his desk like, Oh my god, I found the secret to the Philosopher's Stone. Uh, for the time being, I think Scar should have somewhat of a... Of a less, um... A less surprised look, and we are just going to go with a tired look right here. There we go. We'll, we'll keep that on him until we are until we're ready to animate him. <laughs> oh, Puka, uh, I might have to ask this uh, before, but how tall are you? <laughs> ah, yes, that's right. It was one of those questions that we didn't get to. And it was, it was uh, the the Haitham people saying that, uh, what was it? You were saying that Ellie was short or something? I think I'm, um, I think I'm 5'8". I believe I'm 5'8". Uh, I know I'm two inches too short to apply to be a blue man for the blue man group, if you know who they are. Because I looked into seeing, because the Blue Men Group do hire people. And I looked into all of it and like, oh man, you can apply to be a Blue Man? How tall are you? And there's all this stuff. I'm like, oh, I could do that. I could do that. You need to be two inches taller. I cannot be a Blue Man. <laughs> I'm not tall enough. Oh, man, I could have... Instead of doing these streams, I could have shaved my head and painted my face. <laughs> Instead, I'm shaving my head and doing these streams. Thankfully, <laughs> thankfully, I get to actually talk to all of you. That's the difference between a blue man and streaming on Twitch. Talking. <laughs> right? Uh... Heck... I, I wouldn't call myself tall. I, I, when I'm over at work, everybody is about the same height as me. Almost taller, actually. So I actually feel average or short over at my job. 
because uh, everybody else is kind of kind of uh, at my height or taller. <laughs> Tall. Although I do have to constantly while I'm over at work, it, and customers always come up to me going, Sir, can you grab that, please? I tell them, nope, sorry, I lost my arms. I don't know where they went. It's like, what do you mean? Oh, that's funny. <laughs> they have to give it a couple seconds in order to figure out exactly what um, what I'm talking about. Um, candles. Candles. That's what I can put in here. I think what would look cool in this scenario is candles. Let's look at items. And I'm pretty sure there's some candles in here, too. Let's take a look around. Candles... Duke, 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 duke. I thought there was some candles. But I guess not. And there's a chest pet and chest board, but no candles. Oh, look! Hey, are these tan and candles? They look like dynamite, but I think they're candles. <laughs> um, let's see here. Do, 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 do. I guess we're gonna just have to make up our own type of candle, I think. Um, let's get rid of land and figure out how we're gonna make up our own candle. Let's see here. What do we wanna make a candle out of? Ooh. We could make it out of end stone. I think that could turn into a nice uh, candle. Yes. End brick, am I bad? End brick. We could do that. That will do good. Mm, okay, yeah. Let's let's try making uh, a candle out of some end brick here. Uh, I'll take it out of the uh, stairs. Let's take it out of the stairs. Hey, hey, Puka, Puka, Puka. Psst, psst. Hey, did I last save? Good point. Okay, you can go now. You can go now. Go away. Thank you, little penguin, for the reminder. I do not recall the last time that I saved. Very good. Thank you. Mm, I'm Tyler and Puka. Uh, 180. So, centimeters. Hey, you said, what was what was it? Like 172 or something like centimeters or something like that? So, if, uh, if you're 180. Yeah, not taller by, not taller by much. By much. Mm, I want... Did I duplicate this? No, I did not duplicate that. Let's go ahead and duplicate it. And we need to move you into land. Get rid of this. Land. Good. Um, how do I want to work with this guy? So let's go ahead and get rid of this section here. And that's one of the reasons I wanted this piece. Um, I also want this. And I want to... Oh, that that works good. So fun fun thing for you guys. Any of you that are using Blender. So if I grab onto this, um, the you see this texture. It's kind of squishing and distorting a bit, and stretching and all that fun stuff. If um, if I double hit G twice, I can move this. And it doesn't squish the texture. And I can bring it... Whoa, that's weird. <laughs> what? What is going on? I don't even know. <laughs> okay. So I can bring this in a bit here. Like so. There we go. And now... Um, 
let's do it a little bit more. Let's bring it in by four pixels. We're gonna make this candle four by four pixels. So, double grab, do a four by four here. Good, I think that'll do. And right here, I want to add on another piece of mesh and shrink this guy down. And this guy is just going to be add on another thing. Want material? This is going to be the um wick. That's right. It, that's what it's called. The wick. The wick of the candle, and we are going to make you a dark gray with no specular. We want the roughness to be way up. A sign. Good. Keep on shrinking down. Good. Ooh, ooh, ooh! I wonder. I wonder if I can do something with these candles. Um, I want to edge subdivide, and then. I want to take the subdivision up a little bit. Here we go. Mm. Mm, zoom in on here. I want to extrude this downward. There we go. Let's take care of these two sides here. Uh, that's not going to work, is it? Mer. Mer. <laughs> Let's take these. Double grab. And that's not going to work either. Double grab. I think that'll help. Let's do these ones. Actually, no. Let's back up a little bit. Back up. Back up. Okay, these ones I should extrude downward a little bit. Let's extrude down in the center. Let's take these other ones here. And let's extrude these ones down a little bit too. Oh, that's not going to work. Is it? No, that's not going to work. Hmm... If I just pull you down. Ooh, I like that. Ooh, I like that. I like that a lot. Okay. Keep going with this. Mm. Double grab. Nope. That didn't work. There we go. Okay. I think that'll do good as a candle. Mm, yes. And object set origin to geometry. Eh, close enough. Mm, no, not close enough. Hello. You're missing the bottom. How do you make a face out of nothing? Hit F. F it. Let's hit UV editing. Let's give this a shape then, shall we? Grab. There we go. Layout. Much better. That has a bottom. It has a bottom. And I also want to put the origin there. Object set origin to 3D cursor. Much better. I like that. I like the cursor at the... Origin on the bottom. Mmm... 
And I also need to give it a flame, don't I? Um, how am I going to give this a flame? Let's do this. How to give it a flame. I think the best way to give it a flame is we are going to vertex groups. And on a vertex group, um, this is going to be called flame area. <laughs> Thank you for lighting it. Can you use mesh swap torches uh, as that flame? Could. Possibly. That's a good idea. Hmm. Oh, Ben, I didn't know that you made some candles. Oh. Well, I've already made my own. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Should have looked up about, uh, what is it, uh, five minutes ago and could have seen your text. But that's okay. We're, we're already moved along. <laughs> Let's go ahead and... So we made a vertex group there. Let's give this a save really quickly. And I want to... But Ben's suggestion is pretty good. I like that. Let's do a mesh swap. Add in... Reload the assets. And I want a torch. Let's bring in a torch. Place torch. Okay, and let's move you on over here. And I think the best thing that we can do is figure out its emissions. So what this is doing right now is it is currently using... Uh, if I'm right. Do, do, do. Torch. Oh, good. You can't see it. Okay. Um, let's see here. Torch flame. Uh, main. And smoke. So, main. Here we go. Particle system torch flame. That's what I really wanted to bring in was specifically just this emission. So what I can do is add in another particle system and I want to bring in the torch flame. But I want it to field weights. I want it to currently come out of, no wait, gravity, not field weights, vertex groups. Here we go. I want it to only come out of the flame area. So now, mm, kind of. Uh, not so much, is it? Um, cash. Uh, no. Source, emission, velocity. Okay, and it currently goes to f frame 5000, which is good enough. Mm. Source, not volume. Uh, I want you to do from face. That's what I want you to do, from face. Nope, that's not going to be good enough, is it? Random order, yes. Evenly distributed, yes. Jittering amount, uh... I may just have to make my own off of the top of this. I want you to come off of the face, yes. Uh, cash, velocity, there is no velocity, which is good. Uh, let's bring, the velocity actually is, let's bring down object velocity. Randomness is 0.5. Not quite. Not enough. Physics? Hmm. I may just have to make my own. It's not working quite the way I want it to. I'm just gonna have to make my own. Um, 
Actually, let me take a look at Torch Flame, though. Mmm. Ooh, wait, there's two different types. Hello. It's, there's two different types here. Oh, that's smoke. Oh, okay, there's flame and then there's smoke. Okay. Good enough. Source. We want... Where is... Vertex group. Render. Collection. Torch flame. No important. Import. Flech, no import. Okay. We want you to be our own particle system and we want you to be render render here we go collection torch torch flame no import and oh good lord god <sighs> thank you for the 50 bits grim see wait a little bit and then i freak out freak out when that happens. <laughs> uh, vertex group, flame area. There we go. Um, and I want you to be on face. Source, face. Jittered, random, order. Mm. Mm, interesting. Oh, gravity. That's right. Gravity and velocity both need to be zero. Zero and gravity field weights that's what i want no gravity hmm well i'm about at that point yo yep i think i'm at that point <laughs> um something's not working right and i don't like it i really don't like it Let's just duplicate this guy. Um, scale him up a little bit here. And then we're going to separate by selection. Okay. And then this guy is going to get rid of his emission here. All right. Particle system gone. Don't know what's going on. There. There. That's what I was going for. I should have done that from the start. Shoulda, woulda, coulda, but I didn't. <laughs> Good water. Alright. We got ourselves a candle. Let's go ahead and apply you... Object to parent. Land new. This is gonna be a candle. Candle. There we go. Should have done that from the start. Didn't. Land new. All candles. Put you in there. Um, let's put a light source here. Light source point. Do, 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 And you are going to be attached to this guy. Object. Good. you know about the word well everybody know that birded word bird 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 okay let's move you on in to this area let's get some can oh, yeah that's right <laughs> i was like where'd the flame go oh that's right i need to there we go. Good. <laughs> Creepy Jeff. Oh. Oh man, there's there's so many layers to Creepy Jeff. 
Oh, the way I do Creepy Jeff is with, um, with audacity, audacity, and I just kind of get my normal voice going, um, how does it go? Upon waking, nightmares don't go away. We wait. You cannot escape the nightmare. And then I just add layers on top of that. I hope that's good. Is that okay or should I do some more of a creepy Jeff? <laughs> Every time you sleep, you enter my realm. One day you will never leave. <laughs> Han Solo. It sounds like Han Solo or something. <laughs> I love you. I know. <laughs> uh, let's move this guy down a little bit. There we go. There we go. We got ourselves a little candle here. It does a little bit of uh, flickering just from having the emission there. So let's go ahead. But we could... We could have it flicker. Uh, if we did have it flicker, we would have to have it flicker uh, each candle individually, I think. So if we do do that, we're going to have to work on it uh, later. So let's duplicate this candle. And let's move some amongst the bookshelves. So, fire hazard, everybody. Don't do this at home. Especially in a library. Duplicate collection. Dun, 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 dun. Interesting. All the emissions, too, are the exact same. Look at that. Every single flame that's coming off of that is exactly the same. We're gonna have to make these candles individual later. Duplicate collection. Yeah. Let's make one down here too. And let's duplicate this collection. Grab this guy, move it down the way. There we go. And this is kind of the reason why I wanted the array modifier. So back here you can still see, you can still see the edge of the library. So all I need to do in order to make this room bigger is I just need to increase a couple of these numbers. So bam, we have more floor. Uh, let's increase this number. We got some more wall here. We got a little bit more wall here. There we go. And then this guy right here, we can just increase the number of wall uh pillars bang made this made this place even bigger crazy isn't it um you i want to change up this ladder a bit if i change up this ladder do i change up everything else shading i want to know this uh shift a Hey, hey. Puka. 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 Yes, yes, what? My hey. reader is trying hey. to get your attention. Okay. okay, what do they want? They're, They're trying, trying to get, get your attention. attention. I heard that. What do they want? You're just going to annoy me, but you're not going to tell me what they want. Oh, pretty horses, really. Uh, make the flame particles shadow uh, mode none. I could, but I actually like it. I might... I might do something about the flames, but I may actually uh, make the uh, flame not so much shadow, but I may make it kind of a, a hashed shadow, so yeah, that way it does kind of flicker, but... Um, okay, so there's two types of flickers that I want that the candles to do. So the flames come up, but I could make those flames translucent. 
so that when they cast a shadow, it's not a complete uh, clip of a shadow. It's not complete darkness that it's sh shadowing with. But I could make it kind of um, uh, just kind of a, a, a half shadow. So that way, there's part of the wall that catches more light than the other part of the wall that catches more light. So it will kind of help the uh, that flicker. And then there would be the main flicker, which would be the light that's coming from it, the, the point light. So I may actually keep it partially. Um, mix RGB. Um, brightness and contrast. Hue and saturation. Here we go. Color. Focus cut. I want to bring down the hue a little bit. A little bit in that direction. Let's do that direction a little bit. Right there. I want it. I want 4.80. Uh, 48. That's what I want. There we go. That's the one I want. And then value, bring that down just a tad. Alright. Good. I think that only changes the ladders. Good. Let's bring down the value just a little bit more, too. There we go. Boss normal. Join the game! Quickly, before you can't join at all! I joined, but I suck at it. <laughs> but now! You can join! Hurry, Fox. I'm waiting for you. Ah, uh, I think you missed. I think you missed joining. Sorry. Blop. Do do do. Ba da ba da ba da. Do 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 do. So now those are good. Now I need to bring in some books, I think. So, er, there's that thing. Let's go to this bookshelf really quickly. Whoop. These I need to move back to unused items. Let's t throw those back there. Layout, and I want these books. I want all of these books to... Ooh, no, not yet. That's right. Let's move you back into here for a minute. Nope, not local. Global, that's what we're looking for. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's grab some books, shall we? What type of books? Or uh, how do we do? How do we do? How do we do? Okay, so it looks like there's three types of books. Red, blue. Uh, what if we just grab all of these books? Mm, and new. I want book pile one. Let's make a book pile here. Let's duplicate these things and move them over into book pile. Okay. Then I want, let's get rid of the book pile. I want these things here, okay, to all apply their movement to this shelf. So now all I have to do is grab the shelf and the books move along with it. Good. Give that a quick save a Rooney. Good. And a book pile. You. You need to change a bit. Let's rotate on the y-axis by 90. No, 45. 45. 
Uh, dang it, it's an arbitrary number. It's not gonna be perfect. Good lord. How can the number not be perfect? Let's move you on up and over. These need to move on over too. Right, like so. Good. Rotate. <laughs> Secret of mana boss music for a, for a boss battle. Perfect. All right, so these are going to be our book pile. Let's get into a position that's going to be better. Rotate Y90. Uh, let's take this a Z. So as long as the bottom of these books aren't showing, I think it'll be okay. Because the this side of it makes sense. This side makes sense, the other side does not. Because the book kind of just has an, a second spine to it. It has the back spine and it has this spine, but not the other one. All right, so these ones, rotate Y 90 degrees, good. Good, good, good. All right, so this, um, I think, what if I were to join these? So let's duplicate this collection again. Book pile, let's call this book pile loose. And then this one is gonna be called book pile, book pile together. All of these right here are gonna be one object. So let's go ahead and do a control J. That's all one object now. And then this is gonna be all one object now too. So now I can use our very helpful array modifier again. And I can make these piles as big as I want. So add modifier, let's add an array modifier, but we want to make it on the Z axis. One. Zero. No. Negative one? Negative one. Here we go. There we go. Now we can make these piles of books as tall as we want. Look at those books. That is cool. Puka, does the Riddly thing for the avatars unlock with every boss or just Ridley? Wait a minute, what? Oh, oh, back when we were testing stuff. Oh, that was just a test. Uh, apparently, you can apply things uh, that that don't make sense. And it was just a test to see what would happen. No, there is a, um, there is the, uh, the nameplate dragon, um, dragon slayer. The one that my character has inside of avatars. If you, stri uh, if you kill a, um, a hard boss, I'll give that to anybody that, uh, kills a hard boss. Do, 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 do. Let's see here. So now we need to do the same thing to this. Add an array modifier. And we want negative one on the Y. Okay, good. 
And this one is that pile array one, pile array two, uh, pile array dot zero zero one. And then this one is going to be called pile array array dot zero zero zero. Okay, there we go. Give that a quick old save. Good, good, good. So now I can take these guys, move these into the scene. Perfect. Now we have piles of books. Got the Seth's pile books. Okay, there we go. Okay, mm. now we can add some more, duplicate this, move this on over to here, give it a, another array modifier there. We can duplicate this again, move this over to here. Like so, something like that. And then what we can do, actually, and this is the fun thing. This is the fun thing. If I take this book and I delete this book, faces. Oops, yellow. Delete faces. Um, oh. Yeah. I thought it would change. All right, hold on. Huh. Interesting. Oh, that's why, that's why, that's why. Aww. Good job, guys. Congratulations. You beat the normal boss. Do, 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 do. There we go. That's what we're talking about. That's what I wanted. Can you play simulations? Simulation, please? Simulation. I don't know what simulation is. <laughs> so there we go. We have the ability to not only make the books as tall as we want, but we can also edit each array of the books. So now, duplicate this. And we can make taller books here, rotate it a little bit, and then duplicate the books again, bring it on over here, like so, rotate like so, and duplicate more books over here, take away, eh, take away a couple array modifiers, duplicate again. Whoop, nope, I don't want you to <laughs> lean on over. No, thank you. Add on a couple more array modifiers. There we go. What are you... Oh, my puppy's sleeping. Do you hear that? His paw was scratching against the, um... 
against the couch. <laughs> mm. Oh, no, sorry. Uh, these are. This is actually the the phase of the um, the animation where I have to um, I have to make the animation. So I'm setting up the scene. I haven't started any of the animation yet. What are you doing, Akila? So, I can't really show you. Get your bunnies. Did you get your bunnies? Get the bunnies. Hey, hey. Puka. 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 Psst, psst. Hey, my hey. waiter is trying hey. to get your attention. Puka. Shh. They're, They're trying, trying to get your attention. attention. Puka, what? pay attention in the chat. Psst, Look psst. at the title of the stream. Yeah. Oh, puppy's not gonna be dreaming. You're a good boy, though. I love pup pups. Goodness. Goodness, pup pups. What are you doing? Oh, hi, Remy. What are you doing over there? <laughs> hey, what are you doing? Do you want some treats? Do you want some treats? Here you go. Here you go. Do you want some treats? Yeah, there's some treats right here, Jack. Remember, you can save some for a key tool. There you go. Good boys. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. The penguin. That means that you were actually um, waiting in the stream longer than um, I think it was Wiggly Fox. Oh, wait, wait. I can't say the F word. The F-O-O-D. If I say F-O-O-D, these guys kind of freak out. Here, remember. You can lay down. Good boy. Good boy. Yep. Yep, you were. Alrighty. Going back to the stream. Uh, that one. Let's grab some more of these. Let's duplicate this guy. Bring him over here. Rotate him. Whoop, not that direction. Thank you. Nope. Nope. That way. There we go. Let's give that a couple more arrays. And duplicate that. Don't want to see that bottom. That's not a good look for a book. There we go. Should just make a, a single pile. Sweet Robo voice saying stuff with horrible pronunciation. Gotta love it. <laughs> ah, he actually did the ah there, which is I am finding kind of surprising. I didn't figure that he would go ah. <laughs> ah, do do do. All right. So we got a bunch of books like seal. Let me see about just straight up duplicating all of these. I think if I just straight up duplicate these guys and then bring them down this way. And then do that again. Be a lot easier to work with what we got. Okay, so let's move it a bit this way, too. There. I like that. So, the frame is right here. Look at that. I love that. That is cool. I think this is, this is, this is looking really good. I like this. 
so let's put on AV sync really quickly. Create an array and curve to make the random lengths and have a shader that randomizes the color. Could, that sounds like a, a lot uh, for the books though. I think we're gonna stick with, with what we got. Thank you Grim for 50 bitties. <laughs> could, could do that. So let's go ahead and have this camera. Give me the camera. Camera. Where is the camera? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Where's the camera? Camera. Hello. Is it un an unused? Oh, it is. Look at that. Okay. And then this light. This light is un in unused too. Okay. New collection. We need to have a new collection of uh, camera and lights. So let's grab this. These two guys here. Move you down into camera and lights. And then this one just needs to disappear because we don't have that light. Camera. Hello. Much better. First frame. Give it an eye lock rock scale. Unused. Let's go ahead and move this camera in. So. Oh, we need to increase the length of our animation here. Let's go up to a thousand for right now. Ooh. I don't know why that didn't scare me as badly, but it didn't, but it didn't. It, gosh, it, it felt funny though. That bang felt funny. Thank you for the 50 bang, bitties bang. though. <laughs> felt weird. Okay, let's do a lock rock scale on that. And we are gonna give this a linear movement so whoa way 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 too fast okay slow all that way down yo slow all that way down much better okay still a little too fast i think okay there we go i like this Phrasing. You know, I don't know what I said there. <laughs> but thank you for for uh, for the the uh, warning. Thank you for the warning. Yeah, I like the slow pan in through the books. That that looks great. Awesome. Awesome. I love it. I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Okay. I think what I want to do as well, let's add in a plane here. And let's scale this up. Uh, nope, that's not going to work. Uh, scale it this way. 100 tenths enjoying the stream. I also forgot this exists as a channel point redeem lol. <laughs> Surprising, isn't it? <laughs> 100 tenths. <laughs> I like how the 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 voice is just trying to do, be proper maths right there. 100 tenths. 100 tenths, please. This one needs to be Thank you, Silver. Thank you very much. Uh, right maths. <laughs> right not a single book knocked over but we might actually get into something uh, a little bit more messy because what this plane is going to do is this one transparent 
transparent. Good. What this one is going to do is it's going to make some paper. We're going to be making some paper, yo. Making paper. Mm, let's put one down here. Shift add. Um, items. We want to search for paper. Place paper. There we go. You. You need to have an emission. Let's go ahead and make it a... Oh, this. That's right. That's right. That's right. I know how to do this. I know how to do this. We're going to be doing a hair emission, actually. And we are going to do render um, hair length is really short. Mm, actually, no. Segments. We want two segments. We want as few segments as possible. Render. We want an object. We want the paper. Give us paper. Oi, what are you doing? Akida. Goodness sake. Wiggle waggle waggle. Sorry. Just wanted to see how it sounded. Carry on. <laughs> Wiggle waggle waggle. We want object rotation. No. You're not going to work like that, are you? Hello. Object rotation. Interesting. Huh. Interesting. That's not working the way I wanted it to. Object rotation. All right. Well, what if I grab a hold of the paper and then change it rotate y good okay that's what we're gonna doing rotate y 90 okay good that's what we're going for bring this down a little bit and increase the scale of these things and we want to do uh how do we do this? How do we do a random rotation? We, I, I can have a random scale, but I can't apparently have a random rotation. Not so much. Hmm. What if... What if I have an emitter instead? What if I have an emitter instead? Let's do... Object paper, object rotation, but we're going to do this. We're going to put all thousand pieces into one frame. So all of them show up like so. Rotation. Uh, and I want it to randomize. Ah, dang. Hmm. Randomize a little bit? No. You're rotating in another direction that I don't want you to. Random phase. Aha! Here we go. Here we go. This is what we want. Scale that up. Good. All right. Lifetime. We want the lifetime to be... Oh, goodness. Let's just do 20,000. We're going to have the lifetime be 20,000. And no gravity. And velocity is going to be zero. Whoop. Okay, velocity is going to be 0 0.000001. Okay, good. I think that's going to help out. All right, so now, so now the papers pop in, and now they're all scattered about. I like that. I like that a lot. Look at that. Look at that. 
I like all that messy paper all over the place. Dude, I like that. I really like that. Okay, so now, now I need to give him some more stuff on his desk. Oh, I love that. I love how that looks. Just how that looks right there is fantastic. Good, 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 good. So now what we can do is we can add some more to his desk there. Let's go ahead and add in some paper, some more paper. We'll scale this down a little bit. Actually, that's going to be his paper, the one he's working on, I think. Let's put this in front of him. That one's going to be the one that he's working on. Let's duplicate this. And let's... What? That was wrong. Wrong direction. We're going to scale this down a little bit so we can have some more paper on his desk. So let's duplicate and move on up a little bit. Rotate. Duplicate. Rotate. Up a little bit. Zoop. Just have piles of paper. And duplicate and up a little bit and rotate. There we go. All right, all of these guys I want to join as one object. Let's go ahead and duplicate these guys. And you guys are also going to rotate. Okay, good. Let's go ahead and duplicate this guy and let's bring this on over here. Good. Right there will be good. These two join. Good. Let's duplicate them. Bring it over here. Rotate you a little bit. Duplicate and bring on up. And rotate just a tad. And you two are going to join. There we go. I like that. I like that for sure. Um, Paper. These guys need to go into... Desk. Land, we want you to go into desk. There you are. Desk. This candle right here needs to go into desk as well. The downsides of being a mayor. If we haven't animated anything today, I do like how this looks. Yes, I definitely like how this looks. The downsides of being the mayor. Got all the paperwork. All the paperwork in the world. Yes, that's a good idea, Ben. That's a good idea. Hey, my reader is trying to get your attention. Control S. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Actually, as a matter of fact... You can probably see whether or not I've saved something. Um, so you see up there in the right in the left hand corner where it says Blender and then it has a little star in the top. Uh, you'd have to have a pretty high quality to see it, but it says Blender with a little star on it. That means I haven't saved. So if I hit Control S now, there it goes. The star goes away next to Blender. Epic Tom! Hey, how's it going, sir? Good to see you. Good to see you, Epic Tom. Doo-doo. Alright, so he needs a feather. He needs a feather and an inkwell. Is there such things inside of items? Let's take a dive in and see. 
Um, I know that there's a bottle over here, and I could probably turn this bottle into an ink well. 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 An ink well. Alright. Yeah, there we go. I could turn this into an ink well. Let's go ahead and do that. Move this on over to here. Actually, no. Duplicate. Move you into desk. And then move you in. There we go. Hydrate. Ah, nice refreshing water. Ba -da -ba -da -da. <laughs> um, hold on. I just realized something. Mm. No, I think it's too evil. I just, I, I just realized something, and I, it may be a little too evil. So, um. You, you, moderators, the moderators I currently have are, are fantastic, and I love you guys. But I just thought, you know, if I just randomly popped into the voice chat over there and just go, blah, 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 I might scare somebody over there. And I thought, you know what, that might be a little too mean, so we're not going to do that. I'm going to mention it, though, just, just to be like, you know, that would be hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. Even though uh, Mr. Uh, Mr. Palpatine over there is um Mr. Palpatine over there is do it. Do it. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry Palpatine. I I don't have the heart to currently do that. <laughs> <laughs> Currently. Who knows? My heart might suddenly just give way to the dark side. <laughs> uh, did a boo after being a KFK for a long time and scared Puka. <laughs> uh, I don't recall that, but I believe it. I believe it. <laughs> Was that the cursed one? I hope so. It is. It is in indeed the cursed one. <laughs> 66 biddies for a, for a Strider Puka. That is that is still my favorite emote now. The the pants with the Puka face. Cute though cursed. All right. Let's let's edit this a bit, shall we? So what I want to do, yeah, what I want to do is I want to get rid of this section of the bottle, I believe. Let's go ahead and delete that. Faces, good. And this can just go away. Feed my pets and boop them too. I can do that very much so. Thank you very much for the follow there. Z Radior. Radior? I believe it is. Didn't hit me. Didn't hit me. You missed. You missed. You missed. <laughs> what are you doing? Puppy. Hey, Joe. There's your pop pops. Oh, there's your pop pops. Yeah, your pop pops. I know. You next step one. There you go. And here you go, Rim Rim. There you go, Rim Rim. Get some more Charles. I know. Didn't hit me. Missed me. <laughs> you missed me. Let's add some more. And have some more. Okay. Remy. Boop. Boop. 
<laughs> good puppers. They are good puppers. Aren't they? Yeah, you are. You're a good pup boy. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. You go pop up. <laughs> Boop has been completed as well. <laughs> I guess that is one for sure, uh, for sure way of hitting me with a bit. Thank you very much, Grim, for the uh, the pile of bits. Hug at Heck, no mage grim. Hugging grim, for sure. Hug. That's one thing I didn't do. Oh, I needed to do that, didn't I? You reminded me, grim. I need to make a note for myself. Let's see here. All right, somebody hit me finally. Suggestions. Um. Puka, hug, avatar animation okay so i need to eventually eventually get my avatar to do the animation where he does the hug oh but i also need to get it so that all of the models will be able to do that too oh wait no that's right they should be able to all do the animation no matter what i don't need to do that okay never mind never mind i know what i'm doing Blue ooh, water. <laughs> Grim. Grim. Thank you very much for the 50 biddies. You've you've given a heck of a lot this stream. Thank you very much. I appreciate that very much. <laughs> With a fluffy coat, right? Hugs are better when they're fluffy. Fluffy. Mmm. Let's make this a dark, dark blue. That should do. That should do. And let's take care of this gloss. I don't like how this gloss hey, looks. Wiggly Fox, thank you very much for gifting out a sub to Nova. Thank you very much, Wiggly Fox. Constantly supportive, like uh, <laughs> like Cacto Grim. Looks prettier. Outfit change. <laughs> Outfit change. Puka. Hey, hey. You know what would be warmer than you know, say, just a scarf? Uh, the hoodie back. Yes, that's right. There you go. How about owl's hoodie? I guess. Yes. We'll we'll do that. We've got a system now of giving it back to giving it back to Owl. So we'll go we'll go ahead and get uh, Owl's hoodie on. Oh, I'm glad you agree with us finally. I know. I know. It it it's best when it comes straight from the source. You know, get get the hoodie. Horses. I swear. Owl, where are you at? Owl hoodie. There we go. Get on the hoodie. Yay! Warmer. It would be nice to have both the scarf and the hoodie at the same time, but you know, horses. What can what can I say? Horses. <laughs> I know, isn't it cute and silver? It's like one of the uh, the first outfits that I had for this avatar. And I think it's one of the best ones. <laughs> yeah, they're just horsing around, right? Hmm. Enchanting without a, a head next to your name. <laughs> Do, do. Oh, that's right. I need to put on this really quickly. So that way I don't disappear suddenly. Um, shading. I do want to fix something, though. This is wrong, and I don't like it. 
Oh, wait, no, it's fine. It's fine. Don't worry, we're good. We're good. We're good. Very much good. Let us put a feather in his hand. We need to put a feather in his hand. Feather, 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 feather. On feather notice. Feather. There it is. Place item. Nope. Let's put you off to this angle. Rotate. There we go. Mm, let's rotate you this way. Upward and in the hand. Nope, in the hand. And I want to actually work on adding in some more darkness to this. Uh, let's add in two pixels of this. This is going to be... Uh, what did I name that other thing? Oh, actually, no. Here, I can just look up this. Bottle liquid. There we go. Haha! <laughs> mm -hmm. Do, 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 Bottle. Liquid. And a sign. There we go. Perfect. Look at that. Look at that. Look, look. Just, just, just look at it. Let's actually make it a little bit darker. Good. I like that. And we need to apply the feather to the to the hand. Let's go ahead and do that. Um, um Yeah, let's go ahead and apply it to the hand bone uh to the arm bone rather than the hand bone. Um, because I think it'll look better through the animation if I apply it to this object. Oop, nope, 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 that's, that's wrong. That's wrong. Okay. I want to apply it to that thing, but I want to apply it to bone relative. Right, there we go. Remember to save from time to time. Time to time? Time and time again. There we go. That looks good. I like how that moves. Alright, and then all I have to do is rotate this a little bit. Uh, there's no keyframe, so I'm going to change something up. Let's put the origin point here. Select cursor to selected and then object set origin to 3d cursor there we go give it a quick save there we go all right still moves around correctly but now when we move the feather um local now when we move the feather it'll move on this point here there we go i like that Right, let's get some animation in here before before too long, shouldn't I? Thank you, Murphy, by the way. Thank you for reminding me to save group hug. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot that I have that in there. Nightbot, uh, Puka, pants check. Are you wearing them? Good. Carry on. <laughs> yep, still got them on. Let's put on, let's get some writing movement going on here. So I'm thinking if we have a little bit of, so let's grab from this point, all keyframes. Let's get, bring up that dope sheet. Dope sheet. They call it a summary now. Hmm. For the longest time, I think they called it a dope sheet. I'm pretty sure they called it a dope sheet. Is it still called a dope sheet? Okay. Alright, and then... Okay, how fast is that? Not very fast, okay. Okay. 
There we go. I think that's what I want. And then let's do another random movement. Uh, put on recording. Okay, right there. Oh, goodness. Damn. Oh, boy. Don't. You just sat on your brother's face. Goodness sakes. Both puppies are down on the floor now. Good, good. I like that. Okay, give it some quick, quick, fast movements. He's just kind of doodling in this corner right now. He's not doing mayoral duties, he's doodling in the corner. <laughs> It'll look like he's doing mayoral duties, but he's actually just doodling in the margins. There we go. I like that. Let's give it some let's give it some more power here going on. Uh Uh, every once in a while doing a couple quick movements, super quick movements. Yeah, that helps out. I like that. Yeah, I think that helps out a little bit. Yeah, there we go. Alright, good. Let's see how well this looks duplicated. Okay. Save it really quickly. See how this looks. Yeah, that looks okay. And let's put on the. There we go. <laughs> got the pen moving now we need to get some of this body moving as well just get some uh, just get some ambient movement on the body here uh, we do need individual origins though fast is that? No, too fast. Let's slow this down a little bit. And then stop there for a second and then come on back to writing over here. Okay, good. And then move around a little bit more. Move around a little bit more. So people saying, Puka, pants check. Jelly, jelly, that's right. We should get in jelly, shouldn't we? We should get in jelly, good point. I, I was, it was in the back of my mind before we started the stream and I was like, oh yeah, I need to put in jelly in there at some point, shouldn't I? Checks off to the other paper, checks back. There we go. Yeah, let me get jelly in here. Oh yeah, I like that, okay. Get rid of the bones for really quickly. <laughs> there we go, yeah, I like that. I like that a lot. Oh. It is, it is Mario music. It's, um, the, uh, what is it? Uh, the, the, the Bowser, Bowser levels. That's what it is. Bowser level, yeah, there it is. I love my video game remix. Love my video game remix music. <laughs> Back when, um, 
back when I was uh, a kid, um, I loved listening to Mega Man 2 music. So I had Mega Man 2 for the NES, and <laughs> this is going to date me, but I would pause the game, and I would hit record on my cassette player. On my cassette player. And I had a tape of all the all the songs, all the level songs of each of the Mario, uh, uh, all each of the Mega Man levels inside of Mega Man 2. And I would fall to sleep listening to that cassette player. So, I, it goes back to cassette tape days that I would listen to video game music. And when overclock remix came out i i was just in heaven cassette players yo that's that's how old i am <laughs> uh oh i just noticed something look at this hold on what what is happening here do you notice do you guys notice this cuz i noticed this what is happening here? Look at that. Look at that. I did not notice that before. Oh, no. I'm going to have to rotate these things. Look at that. Ew. I didn't realize that these didn't have a bottom to them. Just give that a rotation in this direction. There we go. Just just, just hide the that stuff, shall I? Just, just give it a hold hide. Alright, so, there we go. Man, that, that's better. That's much better. Oh, these gotta rotate too. Look at that. These don't have a bottom to them. Well, actually, it's just the red portion. I wonder if I can just fix this. Maybe I can just fix this. Give me a minute here. If I just take this, this, and this... And this. I can give it a face, can't I? Face. And this, this, this. Nope, not that. Da da da. Mm. And if I give this a face, oh, there we go. There we go. That actually fixed that. Okay, good. So now I don't need to rotate them all. That one's at least fixed. This one needs to be fixed, though, too. Alright, so this one needs to be fixed. Let's fix this one. Do, do, do. Uh, not that one. This one, that, and this. Face. There we go. Much better. Much, much, much better. I remember playing my cousin's Nintendo with a huge uh, cartridge of Mario. <laughs> with a black and white TV. Those were the days. Yep. Cassette tapes. I still have some. You still have some? Oh. oh, one cassette tape that I have is of a reading of Douglas Adams doing um, some reading out loud some of his Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. That one. That one was good. And he's he only did like a a couple cassette tapes of that, but that's what I have of. Um, Douglas Adams doing his some of his readings. Hmm. Um, it was uh, a section, I believe, where Marvin takes on a war robot and tricks him into shooting the floor. And he's just like, oh, look at this. I can take out that wall. That's very impressive. Oh, that's nothing. I can take out this whole floor and shoots the floor. Hells, bells, and just falls straight down. 
And of course, it's good to hear it from um, Douglas Am Adams' voice. is going on with this? Let me take a look at this really quickly. Red, um, you have opaque, okay, material, opaque, opaque, huh. Oh, that's what's going on. I think I know what's going on. Shadow, this needs to be contact shadow, right. Okay, I messed up these lightings. I need to have contact shadows in these. I noticed something else that there was a problem too. Contact shadows, okay. Let's turn on contact shadows for all of these. Good. Messed up these lights. And uh, this one, does it have contact? Okay, good, I collected that one. And this one, contact shadows. Okay, now these books should look, there we go. There was this odd little clipping of the light and I didn't like that. There we go, much better. Yeah, if you can see right here where this green book is, for some reason I would get, I would get just a, a single strip of shadow right here on the white portion, but there wouldn't be a shadow on this bottom portion of the green too. And I couldn't figure out why. It's because I didn't have on contact shadows for all the lights. Whoops. All right, so now, now coming up here. Now all the, the candles, should have a little bit more light on them. Uh, shadow. A little bit more shadow on them. Paper looks better, too. I like how the paper looks. Let's move this up. Oh, ooh, that, too. Look at that. The monocle of the eye. I like how the, the monocle has a little bit of a shadow, too, right there. Now, now that I've added on the, co the correct lighting. <laughs> uh... 330. You're uh you're you're off on that side of the world then. <laughs> For me it's 630 over here. 630 in the morning. I should be just about getting off of work at this time. Or it's usually the time I get off of work. Lately I've been having a heck of a lot more hours. Heck of a lot more hours stuck in yogurt. Mm. Mm. Yeah, that's right. I need jelly. Bottom corner, where should be the name? The song is... Oh, okay. Remember those black and white TV, cassette tapes. The TVs you fixed by giving it a slap on the side, right? <laughs> Man, the days when things hitting things doesn't fix it anymore. But we do still tend to do that with other things, right? It's just like, oh, hitting it will fix it, won't it? Nope. Still doesn't. Remember, violence and technology are not your answer. Hmm... <laughs> Great time to save, right, good point. Thank you very much, Nightbot. Uh, <laughs> oh, give that, give that, um, give that dishwasher a talking to. Hello, Ninfi, how you doing? <laughs> That's good. Let's get rid of that. I need... What do I need? Alright, so I got Scar looking at the papers a little bit. Um... 
Oh, jelly. Jelly, that's right. Uh, I need to bring in... And jelly is jelly is jelly boy or girl I forget. Um, let's bring in cat mob, and I want cat. What is it? Just a um. What is a cat? Ocelot. That's what it is. Spawn ocelot. Whoa, big cat. Hello. Uh, take Ocelot and shrink you down a little bit. There you go. Better cat. Let's get the right skin on. So we want Ocelot to be... Do, 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 Um... Mix. There it is. Ocelot. Let's grab... Come here. We want doodly doo to do. That's what we want. We want doodly doo to do. Projects, 3D rendering, textures, Minecraft skins. Ben is doing a bomb over in the corner of my eye, as I can see. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's Ben. It doesn't show it in chat, but I'm betting you 100% it's Ben. <laughs> Let's grab Entity and Cat. And we want White Tabby, British Short, Collar, Jelly. Here we go. Do -do. Um, if I grab... Let's do a box selection on this. There we go. And then double grab. Bring it right, wait, what? Oh, that doesn't work, okay. There we go, I think that'll work. Much better. Okay. We got Jelly. Um, let's go ahead and have Jelly sleeping. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Grab this bone, drag it on down, and lay you on the side. Oh, that's a different... That's, that's different. I didn't realize you could do that. Let's go ahead and curl the body. How do we curl body? Um, yes. Let's do that. Okay, go to this bone again. <laughs> uh, bring down this body a little bit more. Okay. <laughs> right there. I know. In animation, everything looks cursed until you get it into the right position. It really does. Everything looks cursed. No exceptions. Actually, we'll have you like this. Like so. And then we want this to rotate like so. And then this to be that that's probably fine I'm thinking let's go ahead and rotate you rotate you there we go and get that kitty tail turning in Move you on up. Okay, and then let's close the eyes. Hello, 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 give me these. These are the things that I want. Okay. 
Okay, all of that, give it a lock rock scale. And move it on to the first frame. Okay. Oops. Hmm. I think that looks good. Cool. Good, 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 good. I like it. <laughs> Take care, Silver. Be safe. Although that was three minutes ago. Sorry about that. No, come on. What, Rammers? Come on up. You're looking at me like you you want something, but it's not time yet. No, it's not time yet. Sorry. You know what that means. Don't look at me with those puppy dog eyes going, but I won. I'm like, no, it's 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 not seven o'clock. You got fifteen minutes left. Fifteen minutes, and then we can have some F O O D. There you go. Alrighty. Okay, let's go ahead and bring back in these bones here. I want these three. That one, this one, and this one. Duplicate. Okay. Okay, good. Now let's take this bone. And then... Let's take that much and duplicate it. Bring it on over here. Eh, not that much. Mm, duplicate that much. There we go. I like that. Like that a lot. Good. Good, 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 good. So now we're getting to, into the animation here. Liking this. <laughs> F double O. <laughs> F double O. Oh, okay. I'm just like, I don't get it. And it's like, oh, I get it. Okay, I get it. I, I fully I fully get it, Mr. 100. I fully get it. F double O 100 plus D. F, F double O. <laughs> you could, you could have it as, as F double O. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure he would approve of that. That'd be hilarious. F double O. Foo. <laughs> Alright, so got that going. Alright, so now now what I want to do is start getting into some more intimate shots of his face. So now that we're all the way got all the way up here. Bang bang. bang. So now that we got all the way up here, now we can uh, get some more intimate shots of him. Of uh, just some area shots. Like, um, so, we'll, right about here, we want to select the camera. Give me the camera. 
I said give me the camera. There we go. Do, 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 do. Right here. Right here is where I want to get some more intimate shots like this. Like so. Right there. So now I'm going to... Okay, and then I'll hold there for a little bit, and then let's do that, and then I want to go over to Jelly. Jelly will be sleeping on the floor. Okay, and give that a quick save. So let me dunk. And then jump over to Jelly. Jelly will be mm, mm, sleeping and breathing a little bit there, and then lock rock scale. And then I want to go up to here. Uh, right about, I'm gonna say, ooh, what's a good angle here? Okay, so right here. So we're gonna actually have to have some words on, the full, on there. And then I want it to sparkle. Like, it's going to be, like, right here for a little bit. And then, right then, let's do a uh, an M marker. That is when the pen starts to sparkle. It does a sparkle. And then, let's do that. Move over a frame. And then I need to get his reaction to it. Okay, right about there. So then the, the pen will sparkle. Uh, maybe a little bit too. Pen sparkles. Reaction. Yes, that's good. And then let's go ahead and go back to that other shot too. Quack. <laughs> Duplicate right there. And then he'll hesitate a little bit and then hesitate a little bit, sparkles, and then we need to go back to another reaction shot of this. Right there. And then I want to go here, and then it's going to be right here. Good. Give it a quick save. So now, so and he'll have his reaction to that, and then. He, he does a little pen. Okay, how does it how does it go again? Let's go back to the beginning. So it comes on in. Um, I'm thinking of having some mayoral quotes at this point of him just thinking about how he's done as mayor. Okay, and then. And probably some pen scratching sounds. Jelly breathing. Just sleeping on the floor. And then sparkles. What's happening? Why is it sparkle? Let me give it another try. Sparkles. Oh, I know what to do. And then he tries his magic again. I'm thinking that would be cool. And then we can do something cool with the magic, but I don't know what to do with the magic at that point. Oh. Oh. Yeah, I don't... I know I want to try. I want to try and get the books to fly around. Like, just fly away from him. And... That's what I want to happen. I'm not sure how to do that quite. Quite. 
Hmm. I'm thinking what I might do is I might remove everything here that you see that's kind of static and just replace it with movable stuff of that during a quick movement of the camera so you don't see too much of the transition. So he tries out his magic. He's just like, I'm going to try out my magic. And then from here to from, to about here, from here to here, I want it to from, maybe a little bit faster. From. So then during that transition, you don't see too much of uh, what's going on with the physics and the swapping of items. So then, that way, all the stuff behind me doesn't have to um, change so quickly, just the stuff in front of me. So everything goes whoom, away. And then there's just litters of paper just flying throughout the, in the air. Yeah, I like that. I like that for sure. I like that. Oh, yeah. Going to work on this tomorrow, and I think it's going to look really cool. I think I'm definitely going to be working on more of this tomorrow. But let's see what we can get done until 7 o'clock here. Um, do, 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 do. Not gonna lie, it and turning into Puka Stream uh, make me kind of sleepy. <laughs> well, we were basically uh, working on ideas, pretty much working on ideas and, uh, and fiddling around, getting things to look the way we want to. Sometimes, sometimes art can move a little and pretty slow. I can guarantee that. Yeah, work can. Uh, animation can kind of go slow. Oh, soothing. Oh, well, thank you, Ninfi. <laughs> I, um, when, when people say that, I do not quite get that. The Bob Ross of Minecraft, uh, Minecraft animation, right? <laughs> That outfit is not looking too hot right now. You Gab need something poop. that looks prettier. Gabapuka. Outfit change. Radio host variant, if you please. <laughs> Radio host variant. Just just a certain variant. <laughs> Which variant of, uh, of a radio host would that be? End of the world radio host? Is it at that you say? <laughs> All right. Puka. Puka, hey, hey, there's a few minutes left. Let's, uh, let's, uh, get into a radio host type of thing. Since we're soothing people out. All right. Sounds good. Sounds good. Sounds good. I'm glad you agree with us. Get up that shush bush. We don't want to see you change and everything. We got to apply some magic, too, in order to make you green. <laughs> this, uh, turning my fur green is, uh, feels weird. Well, deal with it. Okay, well, uh, I didn't notice you guys put in the, those earrings. I noticed the glasses, didn't notice the earrings. The Grim skin. Grim skin? Which one? Which of the Grims do you like, though, Jen? There's like three of them. <laughs> the one where my fur is red, where one my where my fur is neon green, and then uh, a darker green, but with the, the magical sweater. Magical sweater, mind you. Magical. Radioactive. <laughs> it's how I get my powers, or how most people get their powers, right? Is from uh, radioactivity. Right? 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 That's how it happens. Radioactivity. Duplicate this. Bring it on over here. Duplicate this, bring it on over here. <laughs> that one. Lurk. Radioactive. Yeah. It's, um... 
I guess radioactive. Yeah, it, it's kind of, it's a very bright green. It's a very, oh wait, wait, wait. I got it, 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 I got it. Hold on. That's not, that's not right. That's the intensity of the light. Um, here we go, here we go. No, no, threshold. Threshold. Ah, oh, there we go. Now I'm radioactive. Ha ha! <laughs> radioactive puka. <laughs> you don't think Flash was radion? Oh, oh! I need to get that pen in there too. I'm missing some rating. Rating time with that pen. Let's combine some of this. What? Jump over to camera. Mm hmm. Do 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 do. Okay, and then sparkles, right here. Sparkles right there, and then I want to delete keyframes, sparkles. And then bring up the pen. And then keep on bringing it up a little bit, like so. So, sparkles. Sparkles. And actually, let's bring it back a little bit so that we're not inside of the face. There we go. Mm, right about here, we need to have an upward movement, too. So let's do that. Boom. There we go. Good. Good, 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 good. I like that. Give it a quick save. And, oh. Mm. <laughs> Sight against gob kind. <laughs> uh, raid target, J methods. Oh, yes, J. Yes. That is a good idea. What? Goblins aren't magic? Radioactivity is just, uh, magic explained, you know. <laughs> That's how everything works in, uh, in comics. You just add radioactivity, and it's basically just magic. Right? So you got goblins from the magical universe and then you got uh radioactivity from from the world you just add a little bit of magic right <laughs> how'd you get in superpowers it's just magic magic <laughs> no what what's wrong with radioactivity <laughs> Mm, do do fairy magic not radioactivity <laughs> but if you think about it i'll show you ma that's not magic <laughs> that's a gun <laughs> oh no wait no i'm sorry you're right grim it is magic it's called a muggle wand isn't it it's 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 in the harry potter universe it's called a muggle wand that's right <laughs> Oh, it's it's canon in the Harry Potter universe. It's called a Muggle Wand. Yeah. <laughs> All right, everybody, let's start winding down the stream here, then, shall we? Let's bring up our wind down music, then, shall we? So today we got this lovely library all fixed up. Got the candles up. Got Jelly in. Got him. Got a slow pan into into him there, just doing his mayoral duties. 
writing away with his little pen there. Scribble, scribble, scribble. That pen has a lot of ink inside of it. Magical pen. Probably radioactive. Need to get uh, Jelly breathing here in a little bit. Just give it a little cute scene. And then sparkles. And then get, in, get a reaction shot. So that today is the animation. I think we're going to do that uh, again tomorrow. Work on it more. And I'm pretty sure we'll be able to get this uh, quick little animation done tomorrow too. Get it up on Twitter for everybody to see. Uh, Scar turning back into his magical self from, from the mayoral duties. So alright. Yes. Yes I did in fact save. Give it a quick save again just to make sure. All right, let's go ahead and minimize that. Bring up the other window. Puka, pants check. Are you wearing them? Yes. Good. My pants have a hole in them, as you can see. Let's actually de -red radioactivate myself. There we go. De-radioactivate. <laughs> there we go. Less radioactive for next time. Minimize that. So let's see here, raid J methods. All right, sounds like a good thing. Everybody cool with Jay's methods? We're gonna go raid on to him. Do 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 uh, puka raid, and then let's add in do 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 do. Do do do, Puka raid. All right, raid channel. Start raid. Um, gotta get myself up a window so that way I can be in the channel when we do that. Um, go ahead and open a new tab. Let's go off to Jay's place, shall we? We made the best out of it. Um there we go. Alrighty, everybody. Thank you again for coming down with me. It's fun just hanging out with you guys. The Just doing these animations, just a quick one. Just to get some type of project done with you guys. It's, it's fun. I love it. I love hanging out with you guys and getting some uh, animations done. Thank you very much. See you all tomorrow. Um, what's it, Jay? I got, like, I also got such a cool idea for you guys. Like, I know we're just chatting a lot here on the photo stream. You, you guys always know that.